Okay, right now we want to head to Summit County where there is an attempt to help workers find affordable housing. This afternoon there was a celebration for the new development located in downtown Frisco. Matt Croshall live there tonight for us. And Matt, there is really a need all across Colorado for affordable homes, but especially up there in the mountain communities. And Karen, town and uh, county officials tell us they will never really be able to build themselves out of this problem. But they do say projects like this one do go a long way to helping make sure that local workers can stay local. One, two, three. Cut. Oh, the need is, is incredible. Frisco's mayor, Gary Wilkinson, is talking about the need for affordable housing. And this project's coming online not a moment too soon. It was an issue when I got out of college and moved up here um, in 1974, Matt, and I don't think it'll ever go away. Next week, teachers, hospital workers, and employees for the town will make these brand new apartments their own. And this is a great example of how we're able to provide um, housing in the community uh, for our workers. The project green light came with local voters passing ballot measures two years ago to fund affordable housing countywide. Well, we have eight units and then we had one unit on the property before. This may be a drop in the bucket for what is needed, though. This project uh, started, uh, I think, two or three years ago. The housing shortage plagues mountain towns like Frisco, but these towns are coming together to try to help where they can. Think of creative ways to make it work. And a one bedroom will cost you about uh, 1200 bucks a month. That's affordable housing in Summit County. There are two bedroom units as, uh, as well up here. And the county and the town both looking at other sites potentially for more projects like this one. We're live in Frisco. Matt Croshall covering Colorado First. Thank you, Matt.